Lillian Raji here again, Forbes.com contributor for my column, The Pursuit of Luxury. This is the last of my four-part pre-Art Basel Miami series, preparing you all for what's ready to go down next week. Let's now talk about where to savor, sip, socialize, and be seen while you're in town. This Art Basel Miami Art Week, I'll be indulging my palate at some of the city's most talked about dining events and restaurants and teasing your palate with a sneak peek into the culinary experiences shaping the week. Those on my calendar I've RSVP'd, yes please, include intimate chef's table experiences and glamorous launch parties pairing art cuisine with even otter art. I promise, it's all in the name of research. I'm going all in as an insider to discover the tiny details that turn consumer excitement into consumer passion. I have a particular weakness for Japanese cuisine, my only non-negotiable when it comes to dining preferences. Always a yes, no exception. During my gastronomic tour of Lima, Peru, which included stops at world's 50 best restaurants, mainstays like Central, Cajole, Rafael, and Maita, I was certain Astrid de Gaston will, would claim my top spot. Yet Maito, a Japanese Peruvian fusion powerhouse, edged it out with an omakase experience so exquisite it still lingers in memory. Which is why restaurant Queen Omakase is on my RCP list for Miami Art Week, as is a secret spilling interview with its Japanese Brazilian sushi chef, Max. Kamakura. I wouldn't call myself a foodie, but my hobby of booking reservations at Michelin and the world's 50 best restaurants whenever I travel should give you confidence in my perspective. In the meantime, I promise to come with an open palate so all the others on my RSVP positive list. I'll let you know for certain which dining experiences were worth writing about in my post Art Basel Miami Art Week articles with interviews and insights from chefs revealing their secret sauce for how they keep customers coming back for more. As for your dining calendar, make your own RCP list at some or all of the spots I mentioned in my Forbes column between your exhibitions and event attendance. Click through to make your selections. I'll see you on the other side of Art Basel Miami 2024.